howling 50 mile an hour winds that produce blizzards and whiteout conditions lashed the Great Lakes region today and drove temperatures into the 20s and teens deep into the south. It snowed in Louisville. The wind chill in Nashville will hit minus five tonight. In Raleigh, zero. In Atlanta, the real feel will be two above. And in Miami, yes, Miami. The wind chill is dropping to a frigid 25. A space heater following me would be nice. A lot of folks don't have heat, and so this kind of cold air is really difficult to cope with. To the north in Indiana, traction is hard to come by. You could see that that truck that's trying to move it is just sliding on the ice. Drifts as high as six feet have caused major traffic delays and put lives at risk. I don't care what the freight is, I'll park it. My life or anybody else's life isn't worth the freight that's in that box. On Sunday, motorists were stranded for 12 hours near Interstate 65 in Indiana when an accident boxed them in. A number of the vehicles they left behind were still there today. Been on the road an hour and we made about eight miles. Really? Yeah, yeah. So you're giving up? We're giving up. In Iowa, firefighters have been hampered by the elements. The weather's not cooperating at all. Trying to keep water lines from freezing and, and water to the trucks. In Illinois, hazardous is the word that comes to mind. It snowed all day in Cleveland, accumulating seven inches. Schools were closed or delayed there and in the Pittsburgh area. Adding to the anxiety about this storm is the potential for lake shore flooding. And over here at Lake Michigan, waves as high as 14 feet are now being recorded. And that's why that's a concern. Waves menaced Chicago's Lakeshore Drive this afternoon, and the plunging temperatures created another issue for travelers. What's the deal here? Was this ice? Uh, uh, the, the roads are ice. It's probably too cold for the salt to work. Now, the frigid weather is expected to continue on into the midweek, and then on Thursday, a brand new storm is expected to land on the Midwest with both boots. Katie? All right, Dean Reynolds, Dean, thanks very much. And by the way, get yourself a warmer hat. <laughs> I'll try. All right, even though I sound like your mother. All right, thank you, Dean.